So this is going to be a video on all the features of the Volkswagen Climatronic Control. Um, this is in a 2012 Volkswagen Jetta, but um, it should be pretty similar for most of the newer Volkswagens and even some of the older ones. Uh, so first of all, you have your temperature dials here where you can adjust what temperature you want. And if you have the dual zone tech climate control, your passenger can adjust their temperature separately. So as you see the dual um, zone lit up, and mine's at 70, while well, the passenger's is at 76 now. And if you want to set them both equal again, you just turn the dual off, and then they both turn back to 70. Um, so next, you have uh, heated seats in some models. So this is how to activate with heated seats, and then there's different settings for each um, side. And so that's how you just like adjust the heating setting. Uh, so this is um, the max uh, defroster for the front windshield. Um, when it's you know cold outside and you want to get the windows um, uh, less um, foggy. And so next is um, these are all your individual settings. So when your car is not on auto, you can select um, like defrost and um, um, passenger air. And you can just select um, air for the front of your face, and this is for the bottom. So now, right now, like as you can see on the screen, all three set settings are activated. So you're getting defrost, um, air for the top half of your body, and air for the bottom half of your body. And now this is like interior circulation. So if you want the air to circulate inside your car, that's what you'd push. And the last thing is um, rear defroster, so that's like for the winter if you want to get ice off the back of your windshield. And um, so there's two lights on the auto setting. So auto basically controls itself. It'll automatically adjust your temperature based on you know outside temperatures and like what you need to get it to 70 degrees in this case. And there's two lights on the auto button. The first light on the left is automatic with low fan pressure or low fan speed, so it's only at three right now. But if you want a higher fan speed, you can also push it again and it will go to the higher fan speed. So as you can see now it turned to four. So that's the only difference between the two buttons, but they're both still automatic. And um, last but not least uh, is the fan speed button. So you can basically increase and decrease fan speed with um, this button right here. And um, you know, of course the AC, and then you can turn the whole climate control off with just that button. Um, so yeah, this is just an overview of the climate control. Um, if you have any questions um, or comments, please feel free to leave them below. Uh, thanks for watching.